This year's OnePlus 8 series are power-packed pair of smartphones for power users. That said, these phones are competing in flagship phone category now, and those looking for a flagship killer are waiting for the rumored OnePlus Z, another OnePlus phone that's looking to serve the masses. We have known a lot about the OnePlus Z, but a recent revelation reveals a striking decision OnePlus made regarding its specifications. Max J, who has been quite consistent, is leaking information regarding OnePlus devices in the past, has confirmed that the OnePlus is probably going to be the first oneplus phone that's not using a flagship grade qualcomm chip max right in his latest tweet that oneplus z will rely on qualcomm's mid-range snapdragon 765g chip which is second most capable chip in qualcomm's lineup this year and this goes in stark contrast to the previous leak that suggested a flagship grade mediatek dimensity 1000 chip the dimensity 1000 has a comparable performance with the snapdragon 865 and unlike the later it has a built-in 5g modem too OnePlus decision not to go for the MediaTek is weird, given that Dimensity 1000 is more affordable than its Qualcomm counterpart. It seems that OnePlus wants to achieve a very low starting price with the OnePlus Z and that could have made it move to the Snapdragon 765G. Qualcomm's branding image as a chip manufacturer is considered superior to the MediaTek in most countries where OnePlus sell its own devices. OnePlus has so far relied on Qualcomm's name to sell the performance tag on its phone and with the OnePlus Z, it looked to do the same. Snapdragon 765G is not a bad chip by any means. In fact, with Oxygen OS and countless optimization OnePlus makes, the OnePlus Z with Snapdragon 765G could offer similar levels of user experience as the more premium OnePlus 8. And according to rumors, OnePlus will still offer a 6.5-inch Super AMOLED display with a 90Hz of refresh rate. UFS 3.0 storage and a big 4000mAh battery with 30W wired fast charging. So that is it in today's video guys, let me know your thoughts on the OnePlus Z using the Snapdragon 765G in the comment section below and I'll meet you in my next video.